The U.S. military has just revealed its most advanced aircraft yet, a nuclear-capable bomber fighter jet designed to dominate the skies for decades to come. This isn't just an upgrade, it's a complete reimagining of aerial warfare, blending stealth, speed, and firepower in ways never seen before. Military analysts are calling it the most significant leap in bomber technology since the B-2 Spirit. With tensions rising globally, this jet arrives at a critical moment, poised to redefine America's strategic advantage. The question isn't just what this aircraft can do, it's how it will shift the balance of power in an increasingly unstable world. Early reports suggest this jet combines the long-range strike capabilities of a bomber with the agility of a fighter, a hybrid design that could make it the most versatile warplane in history. Its ability to carry nuclear payloads adds another layer of deterrence, ensuring America's rivals think twice before escalating conflicts. The Pentagon has kept details tightly under wraps, but leaked specifications hint at unprecedented stealth features, hypersonic speeds, and AI-assisted piloting. This isn't just a new plane, it's a statement. What makes this jet unique is its dual role. Unlike traditional bombers, which rely on escorts for protection, this aircraft can dogfight if necessary. Imagine AB-2 Spirit with the maneuverability of an F-22 Raptor. That's the level of innovation we're talking about. The design focuses on versatility. It can conduct deep penetration nuclear strikes, engage in air-to-air -air combat, and even provide close air support for ground troops. This eliminates the need for multiple specialized aircraft, streamlining missions and reducing costs. Stealth remains a top priority. The jet's angular design and radar absorbent materials make it nearly invisible to enemy detection systems. Early tests suggest it can evade even the most advanced anti-aircraft defenses. Speed is another game-changer. While exact figures are classified, insiders claim it can reach hypersonic velocities, outpacing current missile defenses. This combination of stealth and speed makes it a nightmare for adversaries. This jet isn't just armed with conventional weapons, it's designed to deliver nuclear payloads with pinpoint accuracy. In an era where nuclear brinkmanship is back on the table, this capability sends a clear message to rivals like Russia and China. The aircraft's onboard systems allow for rapid decision-making in high-stakes scenarios. Pilots can receive authenticated launch orders mid-flight, ensuring retaliation is possible even if ground bases are compromised. But it's not just about offense. The jet's advanced sensors and countermeasures can detect and evade incoming nuclear threats, making it a key component of America's nuclear triad. This isn't just a weapon, it's a deterrent. The mere presence of such a jet could prevent conflicts from escalating, as no adversary would risk provoking a response from an undetectable, unstoppable platform. Stealth isn't new, but this jet takes it to another level. Its coating uses next-gen metamaterials that absorb radar waves more effectively than anything in the current inventory. Even low-frequency radars, which can sometimes detect older stealth planes, struggle to lock onto it. The shape of the aircraft is optimized for minimal radar cross-section, with no protruding weapons or sensors to give away its position. Weapons are stored internally, and even the engine exhaust is shielded to reduce infrared signatures. This level of stealth means the jet can operate deep inside enemy territory without detection, striking high-value targets before defenses can react. It's not just hard to see, it's virtually invisible. For adversaries, this creates a dilemma. How do you defend against something you can't track? The answer, for now, is that they can't. Speed is where this jet truly separates itself from the pack. While most bombers cruise at subsonic speeds, this aircraft can reportedly hit Mach 5 or higher, putting it in the hypersonic category. At those velocities, it can strike targets anywhere in the world within hours, not days. Traditional missile defenses are useless against something moving this fast, giving the U.S. a first-strike capability that's unmatched. The engine technology behind this is groundbreaking. Scramjet propulsion, combined with advanced cooling systems, allows sustained hypersonic flight without overheating. This isn't just about getting there faster, it's about redefining what's possible in aerial warfare. Speed like this changes strategies, tactics, and global power dynamics overnight. This jet isn't just piloted by humans, it's assisted by advanced artificial intelligence. The AI acts as a co-pilot, handling everything from threat detection to evasive maneuvers, freeing the human operator to focus on strategy. In dogfights, the AI can predict enemy movements and suggest countermeasures in real time. During long-range missions, 
It optimizes fuel use and navigation, ensuring the jet operates at peak efficiency. Some experts believe this is the first step toward fully autonomous fighter jets. For now, the human remains in control, but the line between pilot and machine is blurring fast. This fusion of man and machine creates a warplane that's smarter, faster, and deadlier than anything that's come before it. Developing a jet this advanced doesn't come cheap. Estimates suggest each unit could cost upwards of $1 billion, making it one of the most expensive military projects in history. Critics argue that this money could be better spent on cyber defenses or ground forces. Supporters counter that deterrence is priceless. Preventing a war is always cheaper than fighting one. The Pentagon insists the jet's versatility justifies the cost. By replacing multiple older aircraft with a single platform, long-term savings could offset the initial investment. Only time will tell if this gamble pays off, but one thing is certain, America's adversaries are already scrambling to catch up. Russia's Su-57 and China's J-20 are formidable, but they're not in the same league. This new jet outclasses them in stealth, speed, and payload capacity, ensuring America's air dominance for the foreseeable future. Even Europe's Tempest and other sixth-generation fighters in development lack the nuclear strike capability that makes this aircraft unique. It's in a category of its own. For nations like North Korea or Iran, this jet is a nightmare. Their aging air defenses would be useless against it, leaving them vulnerable to precision strikes. The message is clear, if you challenge the US, you'd better be ready to face a weapon system that's decades ahead of anything you possess. Flying this jet isn't for the average pilot. The Air Force is selecting only the top 1% of aviators, with rigorous training in both conventional and nuclear operations. The physical and mental demands are extreme. Pilots must master AI-assisted systems, hypersonic maneuvers, and stealth tactics, all while maintaining the cool head needed for nuclear scenarios. These aviators will become the tip of America's spear, entrusted with the most powerful weapons in the arsenal. The selection process is so intense that some compare it to astronaut training. For those who cut, the reward is the chance to fly the most advanced warplane ever built. Allies are breathing a sigh of relief, knowing America's air power just got a major boost. NATO members see this as a deterrent against Russian aggression, while Asian partners view it as a counterbalance to China's growing military. Adversaries, predictably, are furious. Russia has already called it a provocation, while China warns of an arms race. Both nations will likely accelerate their 6th gen fighter programs in response. For smaller nations, this jet is a reminder of the vast gap between U.S. military tech and everyone else. It reinforces America's position as the world's sole superpower, for now. The global chessboard just got rearranged, and every player is scrambling to adjust their strategy. Hypersonic speeds come with a downside, massive fuel consumption and heat emissions. Critics warn that fleets of these jets could have a significant environmental impact, contributing to climate change. The Pentagon insists it's working on cleaner propulsion methods, including biofuels and hybrid electric systems. But for now, performance takes priority over sustainability. This raises ethical questions. Is maintaining military superiority worth the ecological cost? There's no easy answer, but the debate is sure to intensify as these jets enter service. One thing's certain, this technology is here to stay, and its effects will be felt far beyond the battlefield. Before this jet sees combat, it must survive a gauntlet of tests. From extreme weather trials to electronic warfare simulations, every system is pushed to its breaking point. Early prototypes have reportedly outperformed expectations, with test pilots praising its handling and responsiveness. But there have been setbacks, including engine overheating during prolonged hypersonic runs. The Pentagon remains confident, aiming for initial operational capability by 2030. If all goes well, this jet could be combat-ready sooner than expected. Until then, the world watches and waits, knowing that when this bird takes flight, the rules of air combat will change forever. This jet isn't designed for yesterday's wars, it's built for tomorrow's. In a potential conflict with China over Taiwan, it could strike key mainland targets without detection. Against Russia, it could neutralize nuclear silos before missiles are launched. Even in asymmetric warfare, its precision strike capability allows for surgical attacks on terrorist leaders or WMD facilities with minimal collateral damage. This flexibility makes it the ultimate tool for 21st century warfare, 
capable of handling everything from nuclear standoffs to counterterrorism ops. The bottom line, if a fight breaks out, this jet will be the first thing adversaries see, and possibly the last. America's rivals won't take this lying down. Russia and China will pour resources into their 6th gen programs, while smaller nations may seek alliances to counterbalance this new threat. The risk of miscalculation grows as tech advances. A hypersonic jet could be mistaken for a missile, triggering accidental escalation. Clear communication channels will be more important than ever. One thing certain, the global arms race just entered hyperdrive, with consequences that will shape geopolitics for decades. For better or worse, the era of next-gen air warfare is here. With great power comes great responsibility. AI-assisted weapons raise tough questions. What happens if the system misidentifies a target? Who's accountable for mistakes, the pilot or the algorithm? The Pentagon insists humans will always have final say, but as AI grows more advanced, that line may blur. Critics warn of a slippery slope toward autonomous killing machines. These aren't just philosophical debates, they're urgent policy questions that could determine the future of warfare. For now, the focus remains on maintaining human control, but the technology is advancing faster than the regulations. This jet isn't just another weapon, it's a glimpse into the future. The fusion of stealth, speed, AI, and nuclear capability creates a template for 21st century air power. Other nations will scramble to replicate it, but America's head start is substantial. This jet ensures U.S. dominance for at least the next 30 years. The implications extend beyond the military. This tech will trickle down to civilian aviation, cybersecurity, and even space exploration. One thing's clear, the rules of the game have changed, and America just rewrote them. What do you think? Is this jet a game changer or an expensive gamble? Drop your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more military tech breakdowns.